So I've picked this Smith Row up for a very nice price, 17,500, and we can flip him for over 21,000 coins. So we've made some very decent profit. Let's jump in to today's filters. If you guys are wanting to build a better team like this, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Then look no further than u7buy.com. They sell cheap and reliable foot 22 coins and they also sell foot accounts this year. So if you're interested, click the link in the top line of the description and use code MUZ for 5% off at checkout. Yes, lads, and welcome back to today's sniping video. I did load up the PlayStation for the first time since last Wednesday. And on Wednesdays, we get team of the week. So last Wednesday, I decided to do an informed Ben Yedder review. I wondered where the hell all my coins have gone. I'm on 36,000 coins. I was like, what the hell? I completely forgot what happened. I've gone to my transfer list and I didn't sell Ben Yedder. I bought the guy for just under 300k. So I've took the biggest sell of all time. I'm now broke on PlayStation. And uh, yeah, it's a sad time. So I think I'm, I can get 100k back for him. So I've lost like a couple hundred k, which is painful. Uh, but it's my own fault. I only really play Xbox, to be fair. So it's, it's not a huge deal, but... I've lost 200k, so anyway, I'll try and get a few examples in today's video, but I won't be able to get some of the higher ones, obviously, because I've only got 36,000 coins, and also yesterday was absolutely crazy, my TikTok, I don't want to say blew up, but we had a video pop off, 180,000 views it actually got, and we hit over a 1,000 followers, so big up to everyone that went over and dropped me a follow, if you've not yet followed my TikTok, we're going to be spamming out sniping filters, any filters that I don't put on this channel, I will be putting on the TikTok and also just some other videos as well. So if you go to my recent TikTok, put came from YouTube, I'll drop your follow back. We do have to sell off that Smith though, row though, um, which will jump into the first filter by the way. This is so surprising to me that it works so well because it's an out of pack special filter basically. So what we're going to do is let's jump straight on into it. I need to quickly go check his exact price as well, so we may as well. So um, this is going to be a mid-tier one, so we're going to go to Premier League Arsenal and literally... Uh, you got, yeah, you got to go team of the week. I was going to go special, but you, you have to go team of the week. Uh, but there's loads. There's about five or six that are around anywhere from 20,000 to 25,000. Um, and we managed to hit the 84 Smith row for 17,500. And I weren't even sniping either. I was just looking for the price. Uh, so there you go. you got Martinelli there. Smith row has a couple cards. Ramsdale has a couple cards, I believe. There's the 84 Smith row. So the 84 Smith row looks like he's going for probably 22 and a half. I'll sell it for 22. Hopefully it'll sell... Uh, pretty fast, but yeah, you've got a uh, Martinelli in there. You've got a couple Saka cards, I think. Let me type in 30k. Um, Martinelli, Gabriel's in there. I forgot about Gabriel. So there's just loads. I know it's an out of pack special card, which I'm not always a fan of, but because there's that many different informs around the same price, which is big. Um, yeah, you can get deals like I did with Matt uh, with Smith Rowe. So we'll list my Smith Rowe for 22. That should hopefully sell pretty fast. He does have a shadow on as well, which should help him sell, uh, but very nice profit after tax okay and into the next filter so this one is going to be a low tier one we're going to head over to the bundesliga by munich and left back i'm really annoyed that defender doesn't work but sula kills it sula kills such a good filter we could have gone defender um, and gold ran it would have had a couple of other centre backs in and stuff like that it would have been pretty good uh, but it still works okay it's left back and gold rare i believe they're selling for about 1.4 you could sell it slowly for 1.4 uh, so hernandez is 1.4 he usually kills it to be fair um, and alfonso davies is only a couple hundred coins more i believe he's about 1.8 to 1.9 he might be a little bit more let me have a quick look so yeah, it looks like he might just be under 2,000 coins so if you hit davies you're hitting that bit extra profit the tax is very minimal so you can sell for 1.4 quite easily you'll have to sell it slowly it won't sell quick obviously so you can stay at like 1.2 or 1.1 because the tax is so low and there you go already oh maybe not 1.1 for hernandez so not the most insane profit on there but it gets listed a lot and the coins will add up so we'll list that for 1.4 that'll be a couple hundred coins profit after tax and you can also use it as a sniping uh, as a bidding filter even so go 1.1 any bids you win for under 1.1 of course that will be profit and into the next filter so this is going to be a mid tier one and this is really good for making like a thousand coins a card it's pretty sick it's based around one of the new team of the weeks so Botman has finally gone up a little bit he's been like discard price for a while but he's about 13,000 coins plus I think I think he might be a bit over 13 now um, there is often a lot of supply but oh my god look at the underlifts on him um I think it's because people are opening like their team of the week pack from uh, foot champs but as you guys can see they're on the hour mark so I think he's going for about 13.5-ish if you sell him slowly. Maybe even 14. Yeah, these are all on the hour mark. So he's not actually going for 13. They're just one-offs. Uh, but you're sniping between Botman and I think Clivert's a little bit more. How much is Clivert? 
it looks like he's gone up slightly so he's up to 16,000 coins now so if you hit Clive you're actually hitting a bit extra profit but even if it is mainly Botman that pops up you can make a lot of coins right for the next one we'll jump into another low tier one we're going to head over to the league earn OGC Nice and then we'll go Defender and Gold Rare so this is going to be between Atal and Kamara I think um, so these are I think Atal's about 1.3 and you can sell Kamara for I think it might be 1.4, literally the about 100 coins difference. Yeah, about 1.4. So, again, the tax is very... Oh, it looks like maybe you could sell Kamara off 1.5 even. It looked like there was only one. Oh, 1.4. So you want to snipe it about 1.1. And then you can flip them quite easily. And it get listed rapid, 900 coins. Oh my god, two were listed. We hit one for 1.1. Uh, the one for a thousand, I was just way too slow on it. So we can flip that for 1.3, I think it was. Right, into the next filter, we're going to head over to the Bundesliga now. And Galashi is up in price quite a lot because he is um, a team of the week, obviously. So he's out of packs. So what we're going to do is go 10,250. Um, and that will get rid of the lower rated cards. And then from here, Galashi's normal cards are about 14 to 14 and a half. And we're saying between him... I mean, and all the Leipzig special cards pretty much. But um, I almost just did... Uh, Leipzig and Hungary because these two are pretty much like almost the same price. You've got Sabozalai's uh, first in form. So them two are the most likely ones to pop up. Uh, but you've got a chance of hitting any of the special cards. I'll quickly show you a lot of the special cards. that You'll get mad profit if you do hit them. And Kunku, Andreas Silva. Into the penultimate filter, the second to last. We're going to head over to Chelsea this time. Chelsea, centre-back and gold rare. So these are selling for about 1.4, I think. So similar to the uh, Nice filter. Um, oh, they're actually selling for a bit more. I love that. 1.5. Oh, maybe even 1.6. This is working better than ever then, boys. So you could sell Aspie for 1.6, I reckon. I know there's quite a few pages, but you could sell them to lazy buyers slash slower anyway. Um, and they will eventually sell. And, of course, you snipe between him and Rudiger. And Rudiger's actually 2,000 coins now. So this filter's working pretty sick, to be fair. Um, so you have a bit extra profit if you get Rudiger. Um, so seeing as though they're selling at 1.6, you could snipe at about 1.3, maybe even 1.4, because it's only 100 coins tax. 1.3 for Aspie. And boom, we've managed to hit Aspie for 1.3. So we'll hit that for 1.6, and that should sell eventually. We did manage to sell off the Smith Row pretty quick, so you'd love to see that very nice profit after tax, actually. I wish I got that on, on camera, but I was just trying it out before the uh, the video. And we have managed to sell off Atal as well, and then obviously Hernandez and Aspi hopefully will sell after the hour max. So before we do jump on into the final filter, boys, yesterday's quiz, I can't believe you guys got it. Like A lot of you guys got it. To be fair, I think when one person gets it, everyone just just says the same as that person uh, so i'm not going to give credit to all of you but to the person that got this fair play because i forgot all about tula land uh, so yeah I, I made you guess this card i didn't even give you his pace as well so fair play today's video boys we're going to go with a fifa 13 card so yesterday was fifa 15 we're going to go with a fifa 13 card and this one this is tough this is very tough so this is an 87 team of the season center mid i've not given you his pace i've kept the formation on of course not give you his league as well. So he's got 82 dribbling, 83 shooting, 90 passing. With uh, not the best defensive and heading stats. So if you can get it, fair play. I don't even want to give you a quiz because it's it's rare that you guys don't get it. So yeah, if you can get it, fair play, honestly. So if you made it to the end of the video, just have a guess, even if you don't know who it is. Anyway, let's jump into the final filter of today's video. This is very sick for, again, making like a thousand coins a card. Special Defender. I think these are around th anywhere from 13 to 14 at the minute. It looks like they have come down a little bit to 13. That is a bit annoying. Uh, but they do fluctuate a lot. So you've got this Rome guy. Oh my god, that's a snipe. I might be wrong. Yeah, I was going to say. That's it. Just stays a snipe. So that's St. Just and the Rome guy. They're, them two get underlisted a lot for like 11, 12,000 coins. It's pretty mad how much they get underlisted. So again, it's so easy to make a thousand plus coins a, a card. Um, and you, you've got the chance of hitting any higher card. I think there's quite a few like 81s in here. Uh, there's a Hummels. There's, oh, Munez in packs as well, actually. Forgot all about him. So there's actually three players in packs. So Munez will get underlisted a lot as well. Um, and another filter, I mean, it's pointless. You may as well just go to find out. I was going to recommend Mines as well. Uh, just got mine special. Uh, cause you'd snipe between Sit Just and Bidma, I think he's called. There's literally barely any difference in both of them. But you may as well just go uh, Defender. You may as well. 
because uh, yeah, there's more to pop up. Uh, so you have a play around with that, boys, and you should be able to make a lot of coins. So anyway, boys, hopefully you guys have enjoyed. If you have made a lot of coins, let me know which filter is working best for you. Um, yeah, I was surprised with some of the filters, especially the Arsenal one. The Arsenal one works incredibly, so give that a try out. Um, and yeah, a lot of you were a bit annoyed with yesterday's video. Apologies, but there's not much I can do. Like, I record these... I'm, I mean, I'm recording this at, like... You guys can see top right. I'm recording this at a completely different time. I'm uh, actually really late to uploading this. But, uh, yeah, usually I record my videos at, like, 3 or 4 in the morning. 4 a.m. Um, so sometimes the prices change. There's not loads I can do, really. Um, I mean, I lead, there's, like, a couple hours period where I'm uploading it. So they, they, they must change within a couple hours. So it, it's annoying, but I guess that's why I go follow my TikTok as well. Because occasionally some filters might not work when I do upload them. Uh, but if you follow my TikTok, I'll try and keep you uh, with the updated ones. Just put your notifications on and uh, happy days. We'll make you some coins. So, um, By the way, this market as well, the hardest market to find filters in. I probably should have said this at the start of the video, uh, but it, it's ridiculous. Like Everything's on the floor. Everything. And because we've got no promo out, the only thing we've got is... Um, Team of the Week, because I can't give you Team of the Year filters. I mean, <laughs> they've they've not even got the Team of the Year cards on in the uh, in the market yet. Look, so I'm not put the Team of the Year thing in. But even still, I mean, you don't really want to be sniping Team of the Years. Uh, they're like 1.8 mil. <laughs> it's not much of a sniping filter, really. Uh, but yeah, hopefully, guys, I've made a lot of coins anyway. Um, go drop me a follow on TikTok. I appreciate the support, and uh, yeah, drop a like, drop a sub, and I'll catch you in the next one. Goodbye.